Uh, our most memorable moment to me was that time in Bali and where I was trying to egg you on to jump off the diving platform but you were stuck there for 10 minutes and refused to jump down. I think the most memorable moment for me was when we were in Iceland. I think he realised that the car tyre punctured and then after that he started whistling because <laughs> he was stressed. Yeah. Did you look at her face just now? <laughs> I almost already put a makeup. Oh, cover, cover. This is different perfume scents. The groomsmen supposed to find which one is Isabel. I just want to touch the brush of your warm blush takes me away. And this is damn thing. I forgot that it's American side. Another day without you. You make me feel like I'm brand new. Right, so we heard that you guys are like dancers, right? We'd like to see your grooves and moves today, lah. The Christian definition of love is to truly will the good of the other. God only says that He gives you to each other as helpmates to become more of who you were created to be as individuals and as a couple. God has placed you both in each other's lives to go on a journey of life which you have no idea because of our human myopia. If you actually saw what the rest of your life holds together, you might change your mind today. Because you don't really know what tomorrow even holds. Andre, take you, Isabel, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honour you all the days of my life. I, Isabel, take you, Andre, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honour you all the days of my life. Andre and Isabel, you have made promises to each other. The rings you now wear will always remain a symbol of your vows. Through the ministry of the church and the state, I now pronounce you man and wife. Andre is a joy to have. He's very obedient, never complains much, and as far as studies go, trouble free. He always had a default expression on his face, like that. So much so that my friends nicknamed him as Squidward. This is our time. It's a crazy cosmic journey. I feel fun. Put your hands together. Give the warmest welcome to the final party and the new year. This is our time. There's no time to run and walk without it. There's no waiting and hesitating. There are so many things that I miss. 
I miss seeing you tiptoe around the house in true freak fashion whenever you think that the floor is too dirty. I miss our random AGMs and of course, the biggest of all, talking to you every day and randomly breaking out into singing sessions. I'm also very thankful that despite your busy schedule, you find time for us. Whether it's to help me with menial tasks like writing a personal statement or something more lighthearted. This world keeps coming back. So everyone, can we please raise our glasses to the couple of the century? Andre and Isabel, let's go! This is our I thank God every day for bringing you into my life. Our relationship might be a chance encounter, but it has certainly not diminished the experiences and growth we've shared. Thank you for loving me unconditionally, even the parts which I don't like about myself. Your well-temperedness is an inspiration to me and challenges me to grow and be better. Thank you for making this decision an easy one for me and I look forward to many more adventures with you. Isabel, I never would have guessed that swiping on a dating app while on my daily MRT ride to work would eventually lend me my life partner. We are two very different individuals. Nonetheless, if I had to use one word to describe our relationship, I would still say it's easy. Compromises don't feel com compromising with you, and I love how it takes so effortlessly. Thank you for agreeing to spend the rest of your life with me, and I'm super excited to do life with you. I love you very much.